Hello, welcome back to Pure Data Tutorial and today we have a close look at the message object, the message box, because that's a very important friend if you want to process a text or number information in your code. So with command N, <laughs> go to Pure Data, command N for a new patcher and we are already in edit mode. So as we already know, command 2 sets a message and it says hello. And we need command one, an object, like a snippet of code that processes something. And we want to read out the message, so we take print. We already know we can drag and drop them. So hello um, makes hello. And we can make messages containing more than one information. Hello is one word. It's called one atom. It's one piece of a message. And we can make also a list, which is a selection of several atoms, of several items, so to say. If we say hello space world, we have a message containing two atoms and it's called a list. If we click it, it says hello world. And this is called a list. And we can, of course, make this list larger. So if we want to do like we have a column of numbers, so we have like 12 and 14 and 101 and 0 dot uh, 345, we have a list containing several numbers and we click it. And you see here we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 atoms. If we now take the same list, copy, paste, move it with the arrow keys, and edit it so we separate them by comma space comma space comma space comma space we get a very handy uh, way to shoot out several messages in one box so it says several messages process from left to right so we have a difference between a list here and several messages. These are the, um, it's the syntax you have to get used to. A list is several information in one block of uh, structure and one to, in one message and then we can have several messages processed from left to right into one box and of course messages can contain text and numbers at the same time so we say hello one two three word four five six and you get it this is a list with four atoms hello uh, <laughs> and with a typo of course right so and if we want to execute this from left to right into several messages we go and separate them with a comma like this and here we go several messages Get used to this structure um, because we have to use it a lot. 